Everybody eats when they come to my show. Yes, indeed, kids. It's that time of the week again. Monday morning, Jan Diatri is here for Bath and Friends and Food. Top we're, of the Monday. Yes, top of the Monday. And we are on Facebook Live if you want to watch this Hi, everybody morning. there. <laughs> so Jan has uh, an interesting spaghetti squash meal that is so doggone easy, and I love spaghetti squash. And I have a couple of food tidbits I want to okay. share. Okay, all right, sounds so good. So you've cut, first of all, how do we cut a spaghetti squash without cutting off our fingers? Exactly, so that's a great place to start. Take the spaghetti squash, put it in the microwave. Poke some holes in it first? Well, you don't have to. Okay. If you're if you're cooking on like two or three minute increments don't at a time. Don't put it on full power. And yeah, don't put it on full like power. I, I so did. I would do a minute and a half or two and then stop it and do it again. I would do that two or three times. Then you pull the spaghetti squash out of the microwave cut the ends off okay then you can stand it up and slice through it and it's a lot easier all right okay so that's the first tip well, we want to take all the seeds out so right so then you scoop yeah, all the seeds out. out make sure not to take any of that good spaghetti squash that's right there we now, go now all we're going to do is create this amazing meal in, in the cavity the, in the cavity of the squash and it cooks in the oven and makes its own sauce it's incredible so what like we're going to do is all i'm right. going to uh, give it with a first it. little layer of cheese and I'm using kind of, of a four cheese Italian blend. All right, she's can... putting this into the cavity of a spaghetti squash. Right. So maybe about a cup. If you've or never so. had spaghetti squash, it is so much fun because it looks like spaghetti after okay. it's cooked when you when you put your fork through it. And super high in calories. Excuse yeah. me, in vitamins yeah. and all kinds of Folic stuff. Folic right? acid and potassium and vitamin C and. Uh, other stuff. Other stuff. And now we're going to add better <laughs> stuff, which is a minced garlic. All right, garlic. Just about three or four little minced garlic <clears throat> chopped. Put that on there. And now we're going to get some half and half All right. or cream. And I use uh, that uh, lactate milk. You could you do know. that. Before I do that, I'm going to show you that I've created a little boat here. I've got my aluminum foil on the sheet pan, but I've also created a boat because I don't want the boat to tip over because I'm putting the cream in All there. Right. You don't want your spaghetti squash to tip. So we're just pouring so cream. So make sure you shore it up before you put it in the oven. Exactly. And then, Beth, I'm going to top it off with just a little bit more cheese. Look at oh, look, mozzarella, mozzarella balls. balls. You, uh, there you because go. these Those are all. Nice <laughs> <laughs> Isn't that cute? <laughs> and then I'm going to top it with even more cheese. Oh my goodness! Look this at all the goes in the on oven, this. 350 degrees, and then just for a little color, right. some green onions. I love green onions. And that mm -hmm. is it. I'm going to show you. This is going to go in the oven for at least an hour. At least an hour longer. at 350. I mean, this is so easy. Just go to the grocery store, buy. You know, one spaghetti squash will easily feed two people. Oh, absolutely. So, uh, Absolutely. Now here's a fork because I made All right. you. So this is the spaghetti squash mm -hmm. that has the Alfredo. Just go ahead and All right. scrape it. I'm going it. to scrape her squash. <laughs> See what happens there. Look at that. Oh my gosh. Oh, Look at that. You got this ooey gooey Alfredo with the garlic and the cheese. So yeah, yeah you scrape all that together and you've got instant pasta. Wow. You made with Look at that. Look at that. Look at that. Check, you're listening on the radio. <laughs> or it listen looks like to that. Spa, squash spaghetti, which is why it's called spaghetti squash. And the sauce is already there because you've done it in the oven. That is so doggone easy. You have no plates to clean, wow. right? Because you're just going to roll up your aluminum foil and toss yeah. it and then take this In fact, fork. I would insist the family just come over and eat it at the counter right out of the squash. Don't even get a plate <laughs> no, out of the cupboard. No, <laughs> I love that idea. And then this oh, one is with meat sauce. Oh. So there's no, um, there's no milk or cream in that one. It's just a homemade meat sauce or any store bought meat sauce. You can sauce. even get a jarred sauce, mm. saute dump some, it right on and dump it in there with cheese and stuff, and, and, and just let that cook in the oven. It's beautiful, it's delicious, it's good for you, and it's fun. All right, okay. now I have, a, I have something to ask you. Do you know what aquafaba is? Aquafaba, well, aqua f is water. Yes. Aquafaba. It is the liquid, f I just read about this in one of my food magazines. It's the liquid from a can of garbanzo beans, and it's now being used in baked goods. Fava beans. Yeah. Well, no, faba, F-A-B-A, -A, aquafaba, oh, from the same stuff that you make hummus with. Interesting. So there, we, I think we've all learned something. I read about You're that the so other day. Smart. There are restaurants making desserts with this stuff now. That's incredible. Yeah. And here's another little tip I saw this morning. 
Instead of using butter to make a grilled cheese, use mayonnaise. No, did you? This That's is what the, this said to, this morning. It said it would make it more golden. It won't break your you know bread up when you try and spread it. It's the it's the best tip ever. Mayonnaise makes the best grilled cheese sandwiches. Is that healthier than butter? It's better than butter. Oh, better than butter. Forget about better. health. We're, that's not what we're here for. Well, you are grilling cheese. <laughs> but you know, if you look at all the, if you yeah. look at the grilled cheese sandwiches that have won awards, they all spread mayonnaise I on there. I so. did not know that. That's yeah. going to be my next thing. I'm going to try that. I love the idea. I'm going to try mayonnaise. Oh, no, it, it's fantastic. Okay. Yeah. And you don't, it doesn't taste like mayonnaise. It just gives it a better grilling. It, it does. It just seals it, and mm. it's got it's got a little bit of a sweetness to it. I love the flavor of butter, but you could do mayonnaise on one side and butter on the other. Well, Jan, once again, you've done it. And Isn't here that you beautiful? go. This is about the easiest dinner you'll ever make. Look at this. The most delicious you'll ever eat. The video is up on the Beth and Friends blog at kez999.com. It's so easy. The recipe is there for you. We're going to check in with Mark. You should come up and try her spaghetti squash. <laughs> <laughs> what year was that heart problem you had again? 